I'm here in Pratt's Bottom, a rural Kentish village on the very edge of Greater London. This is one of the places where Sadiq Khan wants to impose the ultra-low emission zone charge. As you can see, this is not central London. It simply does not have the same air quality problems. There's no tube station, nor any of the other public transport options that inner London enjoys. In fact, the nearest tube station is North Greenwich, which even on a good day, will take at least half an hour to drive to. Like many places across the Orpington constituency and out of London, people here rely on their cars to get around. But Sadiq Khan wants to put cameras across out of London to catch people driving older cars in villages like this. The daily £12.50 charge will hit the poorest the hardest, but also NHS workers, social care workers, police officers, firefighters and teachers, many of whom live outside Greater London and have to travel in. ULES expansion will also hit our high streets, deterring customers and making it harder for businesses to recruit staff. If you rely on your car to get around every day, you could face an additional driving bill of more than £4,500 a year. That's extortionate, even before considering how high household bills have risen in recent months. Now, as your Member of Parliament, I'm doing all I can to stop ULES expansion, but I need your help. Bromley Council is amongst several London local authorities looking at legal routes to stop the expansion. And I'm pushing ministers to consider withholding funds from the mayor as a last resort if he doesn't change course. But we need to demonstrate the scale of the opposition to stop ULES expansion. So I'm reopening my petition, which already has almost 12,000 signatures on it. If you oppose Sadiq Khan's highway robbery, please sign the petition now.